Now we need to hear some Sossaman farm history. So I'm defaulting to Scott Sossaman on that. And I have to say thank you for your service. Our retired colonel in the studio. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Retired army colonel, correct? So Scott, tell us a little bit about Sossaman Farms and your family. Um, Well, Sossaman Farms was uh, created uh, in 1916 by my great grandparents, Nancy and Jasper Sossman, who came from uh, Texas at the time. And they actually began farming in what is now downtown Phoenix. They leased some ground down there and found it not too desirable. And then they heard that there were homesteads to be had out in the East Valley. Uh, Back then it was called Rittenhouse, now called Queen Creek. Um, And so they packed up, moved their family out there and um, started working uh, raw desert in 1917. Uh, and that's how Sausman Farms was created. And over time, through di- various land acts, they were able to acquire more property till we had about 1,200 acres, two homesteads, uh, or two sections, sorry, two sections of land out there. Uh, that we grew, we've and we've grown everything from vegetables. We used to supply the mines uh, back in the 30s and 40s up in Superior and Globe, Miami. Uh, we've grown cotton, and of course, we've grown a lot of small grains along the way uh, until we, uh, till now, where we're growing the ancient grains, uh, which I think is a very exciting endeavor on on their part. 